So yeah, some of the most important lessons in building a responsible business. My name is August Bard Brinius, and I'm the co-founder and CMO of Asket, a direct-to-consumer uh, online-only menswear brand uh, striving for and the end of fast consumption, basically. What a responsible business means is that every decision that you take needs to consider the sum of its impacts across the whole value chain, not just the supply chain, but the entire value chain, meaning that you can't just consider, you know, design and material sourcing and, and production facilities and, and um, ethical working conditions but you need to look at distribution and impact of distribution. You need to look at how you market, how you speak and communicate to your customers. Um, and you need to see if you can, in your communication and in your relationship to your customers, um, assume more responsibility uh, and do something to, to contribute to your overall vision, uh, which in our case is ending the era of fast consumption, um, having more people buy fewer garments, um, but better garments, care for them longer uh, and appreciate them more. So responsibility for us is really super holistic. It's the entire value chain. As far as possible, trying to sit down and really put pen to paper and outline what it is you want to do and, and why you want to do it. You know, the more you grow and, and um, uh, the longer you work on it, the harder things get. And um, it's not easy to, to pivot um, an existing uh, model and an existing offering and an existing brand into something that, you know, it wasn't, um, it wasn't created for in the beginning. Secondly, I would decide on a, a focal area. Fashion is huge, it's vast. The fashion supply chain has so many things to consider when it comes to responsibility, you know, um, the chemicals involved, um, the water, irrigation, um, working conditions, um, the waste. There's just, there's a lot to tackle. And as a small business or as a startup, um, it can become overwhelming. Um, so what was important uh, for us from the very beginning was our mantra of less is more, um, you know, creating the best possible products that would outlast anything uh, else that you have in, in your wardrobe. That was really helpful in just, you know, setting a very clear direction. So, you know, um, not all of our product uh, lineup right now is, is organic cotton um, as an effect of this, because in the very beginning, everything we wanted to do is to maximize the lifetime of these garments, both in terms of quality and in terms of uh, design. And you know, five years ago, the, um, the offering in terms of uh, organic cotton wasn't as strong as it is uh, today. Uh, and now we're, we're transitioning and we're reevaluating that. But it was really helpful for us to just, you know, um, set that path from the very beginning. Um, our bar was always the maximum lifetime of the garment. Uh, and, and, and that's gonna exclude certain materials, it's gonna exclude certain designs, it's gonna exclude certain um, suppliers for you and, and help you make, um, and the right decisions um, so and, and help you focus uh, because um, there's a lot to do and there's a lot that you might want to do um, but you can't do it all and you can't do it alone.